Hello, once again, we are playing FTL. We're gonna do new game, and this game is gonna be a little bit special because now we have the Stealth Cruiser. I almost didn't see it, and I was gonna ask where it was because, as you can see, the other ones are blacked out too, so I was like, oh, where is it? Anyways, that's it. Um, we're gonna name it, I don't know, how about the Ninja? Because you can't really see it. And we also have our crew members. So, um, I don't know, we'll just name it, I mean him, we'll name him, Sushi, because I think that's a pretty scary name, personally. Elizabeth, you can be, uh, you look like the sumo type, no offense. And finally, my fan, uh, yeah, you're going to stay my fan. Let's look at our achievements that we could use to unlock uh, Layout B. Bird of Prey, destroy a ship at full health during a single cloak in the stealth cruiser. That sounds a bit difficult. Uh, with the stealth cruiser, avoid 9 points of damage during a single cloak. Uh, that's possible. With the stealth cruiser, get to sector 8 without jumping to a beacon with an environmental danger. Hmm, sounds... that one sounds pretty difficult as well. So as you can see, we'll have the mini beam, which I've never seen before. Extremely cheap and weak beam weapon. Alright, sounds promising. Um, dual lasers I have seen before. And let's see, so... Pretty basic stuff. With the exception of the engines, I think. And cameras are also good. And as you can see, we have our cloaking device. So we're going to start. And let's just delegate here. Who should be commanding this ship? Uh, hmm. I think my fan should be... Oh yeah, we don't have shields. Okay. You're gonna go there. And you're gonna go on weapons. So, I don't actually think there's any benefit in having... Um, hold on. Manning increases dodge chance. Yeah, there's no point in having someone in the cloaking room, but I guess that's okay. I mean, this could be our repair person. So, let's just put some energy into our, um, I don't know, our systems here. And we're gonna jump. And thanks to some kind of ship um, augmentation, that'd be the long-range scanners. We can see what kind of beacon we're going to get. What is this? All system, all ship systems have additional plating that provides a 15% chance to negate damage when hit. So that's actually going to help us a lot considering we don't have a shield. So the question is, where, do, where should we go? Possible ship detected. But this one is close to the sun. We want to go there, so let's just go here. Let's try out this ship. And we, of course, have to reject their offer. So let's see who regrets what. Um, shoots two lasers that do one damage each. One damage per, ro per room beam weapon. Um, so first step would be to get their shields down. So that is exactly what we're going to do. And uh, should we cloak? I don't know. I kind of want to shoot and then cloak. I think that's a good idea. Cloak and then we'll be recharging. And let's get this beam. Uh, how does it work? Okay, so there's no benefit to uh, hitting systemless rooms, which there sometimes is. So, oh, that is a small beam. It's quite mini. Um, I think this is our bet best option here. So I'm gonna wait for the. Oh, okay. I'm not gonna wait. I need to fix that. And in the meantime, we might as well cloak. So as you can see, the benefit is that we get to uh, do stuff without getting hit. And Sumo's dying, but I think... Okay, let's move Sumo into the med bay. And we'll see if we can deal with these fires. Hmm. This is not so good. We can't really dodge anything. Um, we can't cloak yet. This fire is annoying. 
See, I could open the doors and try and suffocate the fire, but then it would probably take long. Okay. Um, yeah, too many fires for me to deal with, so here is me opening the doors. And I guess we'll just keep cloaking until, uh, until we can kind of handle uh, our weapons. So, medbay desperately needs to be re repaired, so let's do that. Hopefully Sumo doesn't die. Okay, they, they are restoring health right now, so that's good. Fires are gone. Okay, we can also cloak while we're waiting for stuff to happen. So I'm opening these doors to allow air to fill up this room again. Um, mm, I guess I want to send both my guys to the weapon room. And let's just open more doors for good measure. We've taken more damage than I would have liked. And I think we're about to take more, yep. Just repair something, come on. Cameras are down. Okay, just don't let anyone die. We need that. Don't go for weapons. And now we can power that up. <sighs> okay. Duel, you're gonna go on shields. The ship's not even that well equipped. Stealth ship, uh, I'm just having an awful time with it right now. Uh, let's restore you, and you can work on... I don't know. Cloaking, I guess. Okay, now you're dying too, so let's just restore everyone. <sighs> I don't like this ship. I can't really do too much. Let's do a mini beam. Oh no. No, this is going really badly. Okay, uh, one hit should do the trick. Alright. Uh, that was only the first battle and we've already taken so much damage. Okay, repair time. Oh, we have fires? Great. Oh, even more. Uh, okay, let's get you on camera so we can see what's going on. And might as well open some doors. Okay, that's what's going on. And we only have this set of doors that leads to the outside. So it could be a bit of an issue. I have to open that too. We've actually taken... We're taking damage from this. Uh, okay, you guys need to work on that, I guess. Ooh, uh, it looks like we're gonna die. Um, get out. Hmm. There's an achievement to, that says, uh, some people just want to watch the world burn. And you have to have every tile on fire. I can't actually control the doors, which means I can't really control the fire, so... Yeah, we lost uh, my fan, so that's what happened there. And I can't really do anything. I just have to wait. Um, yeah, I don't even know what to do. Can't jump because uh, need a pilot. Actually, mm, let's just see if you can make it. The fires are actually going out. So that's good. We could actually make make it somewhere. Okay, now we can jump. I uh, can't control the doors. Hmm. Seems like a suicide mission to go try and repair the doors. Or even this room. We're just gonna jump. Um, I don't know. This... what is this? No signs of life. Okay, well, uh... GG, as they say. So this is probably going to be a fight, and it's probably going to be our loss. Um, yeah, can't use weapons, so good game. Yeah, the stealth cruiser is pretty hard to use, or maybe I just got unlucky, I don't know. 
Man, that was awful. 96. Okay, um... We're gonna go back to the hangar and see if we can maybe make something else work. Let's try Zoltan Cruiser. Haven't done that in a while. And which... Actually, uh... I want to do like a different kind of ship that I usually do, so... Uh, was it the Kestrel? It was like a one-man thing. But, I don't know. Um... We might as well try and unlock layout B for the... Uh, the last run, which was a three-hour one, by the way. Um, it was very long, so... I... Hmm... Yeah, and that was an NG cruiser, so I don't want to do that again. Do we give this one last shot? Hmm. Yeah, I'll give it one last shot. Uh, we're not gonna bother naming stuff again. It's just not worth it, you know? So let's have everyone just around this general, general area this time. Um, yeah, so, let's just go this way. Um, yeah, they've teleported, so let's get our men. No, we'll get one, we'll get Martin to deal with him. And should we cloak? Yeah, let's cloak. This will give us... Uh, a bit of a head start in terms of weapons, since theirs can't charge up unless they see us. The shields are still up, so I'm gonna have to wait till those are completely down before using my beam. Which should be any second now. They've done quite a bit to us. We're gonna deal with that fire first. Medbay! Not too vital at this point. Okay, now we can deal with their stuff. I wouldn't mind having them leave, so I'm gonna leave their um, teleporter alive. So, hmm. Maybe I should just swap out here. Yeah, I think that was a good idea. Dual lasers on weapons. Do I actually want to kill this guy? Because I could. Um. Hmm. So if I kill him, what's the benefit? Uh. I get more, uh, progress for fighting. Or combat or whatever. Um. That's the only downside I see. So. Yeah, let's just try and kill this guy. Uh, we're gonna do a mini beam here, I think. Two rooms, that's good enough. Two missiles, uh, that's not very much. I don't need missiles or drone parts, so not a good deal. Oh, he got away. Oh well. Uh, they are nearly dead, which is good. And let's... Mm, we actually desperately need oxygen, so let's get that fixed. Oh, but we need the doors first. The doors. Hopefully we don't lose as a result of me neglecting to repair stuff. That'd be disappointing. Um, did we just fire? No, there's... Now they're dead. Okay. So we got a little more scrap and fuel, which is kind of what I, what I needed most. So now we can close our doors and have some oxygen... Well, the remaining oxygen fix itself, I guess. Uh, we'll have you two fix it since you have most health. We'll have you try and work on the med bay. So we didn't take too much damage that time. That's kind of a better start than last time. Hopefully you agree. Raffin and Notch. Good names, pretty solid. 
Um, do they, do they need to heal? 86, 89, and they should be at 100, is it? Yeah, uh, might as well heal them. And can we upgrade anything? We can get power, which would give us evasion at least. Um, doors and piloting, not really that useful. So yeah, we'll do this. Evasion will probably be where we want to invest, considering that we don't have shields. So now that everything is just fine, we'll go to the distress beacon. So we'll try leading them, even if it might be a trap. We got some scrap, so that's nice. They want to go there. Um, that's fine by me. So of course I'm avoiding the um, kind of weather condition beacon. They're trying to get away. Um, is there any point in beam in uh, cloaking? I guess so. Yeah, so we're gonna cloak and aim for. I want to say shield, but then yeah, I guess shield. Start with shield, and then we'll work on immobilizing them. That cloak is really short. I mean, it's still useful. It's just I'm, it's just kind of short. So, oh, they're still charging, so that's not good. I thought they were delayed, but apparently not. Target the engines, I guess. Um, we'll send one person to repair. Who's specializing in what? Notch is good at repairing. Also piloting. I guess he was the original pilot. Um, might as well switch that. Raffin, you haven't really done anything. Martin, you're good at repairing, so let's see, we'll put you there. Uh, Notch, you're gonna go here. And you are gonna repair, I don't know, cloaking. So now they're delayed, which is good news for us. And we're gonna go for weapons now. And wow, that. That was quite the effective ion bomb thing. I don't know. Um, they're almost dead, so we'll kill them and then see what we can do. And there is the kill. We're about halfway down for damage. Nine scrap, that's not too much. Oh well. So now it's repair time. And it looks like we have a fire, great. And we have a breach in the hull, that's not good. Yep, a lot of fire. You can do it, Martin. Ooh, that's scary, get out. Ooh, that, that could have been bad. Might as well get Notch to repair stuff. Can you handle the fire? Can, can you feel the burn? Um, yeah, so he felt the burn. And he overcame it, and that's what makes him a hero. Okay, so things are going well. Um, cameras are getting fixed, everything's... Everything but the doors are getting fixed at the moment. Uh, we're gonna repair you, or uh, heal you, I should say. And now our engines are good, so Notch, you can go back here. And Raffin, you were you're, you're the weapons guy, so so pardon me. Um, doors are good now. All right. So we're doing significantly better than last time, although not as great as I would hope. Um, yeah, let's try and get to the quest beacon as soon as we can, I guess, even if it means going through these dangers. You have to turn and fight. Okay, uh, first step is cloaking. Next step is aiming. 
I wonder if cloaking makes us uh, immune to the asteroids during our time. Maybe. Alright, so this was a very good event that happened. They got hit and then we took out their shields. So I guess weapons are a threat, so let's go for three rooms here. Our cloaking got disabled. You get in there, Martin. And then we'll see what happens. They're getting hit a lot, but mm, we're getting hit a bit, I guess. Um, let's go for weapons, I guess. Nine scrap. You guys have got to do better on your bargaining skills. Mini beam. That's gonna kill you guys. Sorry. No hard feelings. Hopefully. I mean, you won't feel anything. Yeah, 13 scrap. We are not getting very much scrap. And we need to get out of here as soon as we can. Um, doors are broken. That could kill us. Ah, uh, there's an asteroid. Okay, it missed. Uh, we could also upgrade stuff. Ooh. Okay, so this wasn't a trap for once. Scrap and long... We already have long range scanners, but we can sell them at the least, so... Chapez... You break it down into scrap, so we got more scrap. Awesome. Um... Okay, let's get working on the doors. The doors. Um, no store nearby, which is a bit unfortunate. Because we could use the... Uh, repairs, obviously. So, once Martin's done, we can... I don't know. What can we do? Um... Ship. And, okay, so... As I mentioned before, evasion is quite nice, and... Also cloaking, because, uh... 10 seconds is a lot better than 5. As you might expect. Either way, we need power. And we could actually... No, we have to choose one or the other. Um, evasion or cloaking? Uh, cloaks the ship, adding 60 to your evasion. Oh, okay, that's how the evasion thing works. Uh, I feel like long-term engines are going to be better. So, yeah, let's do engines. And that looks good to me. Hopefully it looks good to you. Seven missiles. Hopefully we come across a ship that wants to buy them. Because that does happen. Cloaking time. And it's laser time. So, as you can see, evasion is at 90, which is not quite 100%. I think I had close to 100% once, and it was really, like, not fair for them. Okay, um... Let's just go like this. Sweet. So they only have two crew. I would like to get some new ships at some point. I'll have to look into that. Um, nine scrap again. What is with this? So is it no damage for systemless rooms? Is that how it works with rock ships? I don't know. 16 scrap. That's a lot better. And fuel. That's what I needed. Please be the sh be a shop. Uh, we can venture down this way. Or this way. We're pretty low on health. Uh, I could buy this. If I wanted. Now, do I want this? Uh... Hmm. I guess so. And we'll need more power at some point. We'll just venture this way. Okay, once you arrive, your screen lights up. Blah, blah, blah. Crew manages to keep them. So, engines are down is basically what happens. So, cloaking for 10 seconds. That's significant. And we're gonna go for shields. 
as usual. So yes, cloaking is pretty nice. Actually, 10 seconds is pretty significant. Um, we still need to take out their shields. So now we play the waiting game. And now we win at the waiting game. So I can take three rooms this way. Three this way seems like the best deal. So we'll do that. That did three damage, which was good. Still evasion at 10%, that's not too good. Um, momentarily, we should be able to cloak again. Let's attack their shields. And one last beam should do the trick. They got a shot on us, but we killed them. 17 scrap, 4 fuel, that's that's uh, not bad. And now we repair. Still not enough to uh, get the power bar. We could upgrade doors or piloting. Um... I don't know, I don't think that's too necessary at the moment. Doors I like to upgrade, but power is better, I think. Oh, you know what? I should have had Martin on engines, because that, that's where the boost was. I'm used to having someone on weapons and shields, I guess. But yeah, I'm, I'm getting old. So with that, let's jump here. We have a lot of fuel. That's that's always good, I guess. Um, yeah, we can't buy a slave, but we can attack them or ignore them. I like to attack them, but considering our hull, I don't know. Let's attack them. I haven't really got much to lose. An extra crew member would be nice. I don't know if it's necessary though. Hmm, their um, combat drone can still hit, hit us when we're cloaking, I guess. Oh, well, our evasion's not um, complete anyway, so that makes sense. Although it is annoying. We could actually lose very soon. I can't really do damage to them. One more hit. Yeah, we're pretty much dead. So that has been two bad um, stealth cruiser runs in a row, but this time we got th 388, which is, you know, pretty good, I guess. Not really. Stealth cruiser is hard. That's my only excuse. So, uh, main menu. Thank you guys for watching this kind of embarrassing video, but I hope I hope that you enjoyed it. Um, probably not going to do the stealth cruiser in a while, but for now, this has been FTL, and I'll see you next time.